press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update. Strawberry is one of the most significant profitable soft fruit. It is easier to grow. Any individual can start marketable strawberry farming with small capital investment. Strawberry farming has become a trend now. Due to the huge market demand for this fruit, commercial farming of this fruit is very successful. If you are planning to grow strawberry, you can gain huge earnings within a very short time. It is an annual herb which bears the red colored berry. It is normally grown in colder regions. With the advancement in technology, you can find many higher varieties, which can be grown in diverse regions of the world. With proper agriculture techniques and implements, you can increase the yield of the strawberry manifold. You can sell to other countries huge quantities of strawberry and earn good revenue from it. You need to give sufficient plowing and trench into the main field before implantation the runners. You can either plant them on a flat bed or raised beds. The depth at which the plants must put in the soil must be very accurate. The top portion of the soil must remain outside and the roots must bury inside the soil forthwith after planting, irrigation is required. The best time to plant the runners in the field in September to October. If you plant them too early or too late, the yield is affected. The runners are taken from the nursery and planted in the main field to give ample growing space among plants. Usually, a spacing of 30 centimeters to 60 centimeters is given. However, space may vary based on the type of the land and the variety which you are cultivated. To control weeds in your strawberry farm, mulching is the best system. It serves a multifunctional purpose. It checks the growth of weeds, improves the yield, and prevents injury to the fruits from freezing. For mulching, you can use double or black colored polythene or straw. Since strawberry plant grows shallow roots, you have to careful while using weeding implements. Most of the varieties of strawberry plants are self-pollinating. In case of single set flower producing varieties, you can use honeybee colonies to pollinate the flowers. Planting early in autumn allows the plants to make good nascent growth before the onset of winter. However, in this case, you must irrigate the newly planted runners frequently after planting. Otherwise, the mortality of the plants becomes high. When fruiting starts, you must provide the frequent irrigation on daily basis. At this stage, frequent irrigation gives larger fruits. Strawberry requires moderate amounts of nitrogen. Therefore, you must apply the organic matter to the soil. It improves the water holding capacity of the soil, and also gives better runner formation. Normally, the application of adequate amounts of nitrogen gives the higher yield of early berries. You must protect your strawberry farm from pests and diseases. Red spider mites and cutworms are significant pests of strawberry. Additionally, the two operable diseases of strawberry are red steel, caused by the fungus photography fragrance, and black root rot. Normally, you can harvest strawberry when half to three to fourths of skin develops color. Depending on the weather conditions, you can pick the fruits on every second or third day usually in the morning hours. Additionally, pick the berries by nipping off stalk and not holding the fruit generally. Mechanical harvesting reduces the cost of production. In commercial strawberry farming, you can expect an average yield of 8 to 12 tons of fruits from 1 hectare of land. If you have any question, you can comment below on this video. Finally a request, please don't forget to subscribe this channel, and stay with us.